Okay guys, so the first thing we need to do is import the libraries that we need to use uh, to train and test the data. Okay, I'll put a description in the uh, a link in the description with the GitHub uh, repo and you can download the playbook from there. Okay, so import pandas as pd. So we need to do this because the first library that we'll be using is, uh, you know, pandas to load the data frame correct and yeah and then we do basically df is equal to pd dot read underscore cs salary data dot csv okay and then we need to put it like this right so now it doesn't like something so i think we have this is wrong okay so now we have read this csv file into the df data frame okay and if you want we can just type this and view the data frame okay or else if you just want to look at a few columns you could just do df dot head or you could put like 10 here if you want to look at the first 10 data could do a tail to look at the last uh, rows all right so now that we have this let's see how many entries we have so the way to do that is we can just use length.df so we have a total of 30 entries okay into our column so after that it's now we need to visualize our data import map dot dot s p l t okay now we've done that so we just need to plot this data now to understand what kind of data we are doing looking at visualization generally helps uh, to understand what kind of data it is and what's the relation between this data and what kind of algorithm we want to use for this right so uh, plt dot scatter okay so from here we were able to see the columns years experience df dot head so that i just get a few columns so i'm going to take this which is the x which we discussed from the excel okay and then i'm just going to put it here and then i'm going to use this and then the same thing I'm just going to give it salary which is this column okay and then I'm just going to ask it to plot it so now we have our X which is here 2 4 6 8 10 and then we have our salary which is the Y all right and we see they have a linear relation so the reason I say it's linear is because it's an upward slope it could either be like this but we can basically imagine a line going across these dots so what this says it's a positive uh, linear relation so the number of years the more experienced the person is the more salary you know we can expect them to get so yeah so that's uh, how you would you know plot the data and visualize it